One dream is connected to another, which means we must choose in which sleeping world you will begin. I will return you to the Destiny Islands just before they were swallowed by the darkness and plunged into sleep. Once dreams take you, you must let them guide you to the sleeping worlds. As there are seven pure lights, there are seven sleeping keyholes. Unlocking these will both grant you new powers and free the worlds from their wakelessness. Complete this task and return here safely, and I will name you both True Masters. Stop her! <laughs> huh? You there! Have you seen a gypsy woman? Nope. Sorry. All right. Thanks. I'm terribly sorry, sir. We've lost her. Slippery vermin. I'm beginning to question having summoned you back from the wars, Captain Phoebus. Thank you. You stood up for me. I'm Esmeralda. Riku. And it's not like I know what a gypsy is. Why are they chasing you? Judge Frollo has been hunting us for years. We gypsies are guilty of nothing but loving our freedom. Yet Frollo hates whatever he can't control. Now he's even brought in fresh blood to torment us. <sighs> I'd hate to know what darkness drives that man. I think I can imagine. Tell me more. Was he always like this? I don't give Frollo much thought. But, if you'd like, you could try Notre Dame. They say it's a place for answers. Is anybody here? Who... who are you? I'm Riku. Oh, my name's Quasimodo. I'm very sorry, but the Archdeacon is away. Actually, I'm looking for a man named Frollo. Do you know where he is? My master? He said he had business on the outskirts of the city. Do you mean you know him? Oh, yes. He's... he's very kind. Master Frollo saved my life. He protects me from the outside world. He protects you from it? The people out there would be cruel to me. I'm a... monster, you know. Is that what Frollo told you? Trust me. Looks can be deceiving. A good friend sees you for who you are, no matter what face you wear. You should go out there. Find some friends who understand you. Oh no. My master forbids it. I'm not to set foot outside. Are you sure that's what's stopping you? Because I think something else is holding you back. Ask your heart, Quasimodo. I'll check the edge of town. Thanks. Wish I could take my own advice. And a big one.
What? Uh. Huh. Not like this is fair. No use. I gotta run for it. Stand aside, Captain Phoebus. I will not. What have these people done wrong? I have proof this family gave harbor to gypsies. That's not a crime. I can think of few crimes that are greater. No. Oh. <laughs> what demon is this? Oh, you are mistaken, Captain Phoebus. This is no demon. It is righteous judgment. I have been granted this power so that I may smite all gypsies, now and forever. This is all wrong. He won't listen. Once you've fallen that far, there's almost no coming back. How dare you? I am a virtuous man. Good and evil shall be made plain. Once the gypsies face the fires of judgment, <laughs> no, you don't! You all right? Well, I can't say you didn't warn me. You should take it easy. I'll deal with Frollo. Thanks. I gotta tell you, this is embarrassing having to rely on a kid. You wouldn't be the first. Sorry. <laughs> I'll admit, you look more capable than me right now. All right. Be careful. It looks like that creature is heading for the cathedral. Okay. Got it. You've come to Paris in her darkest hour, Captain. It will take a firm hand to save the weak-minded from being so easily misled. Misled? Sir? For twenty years, I have been taking care of the gypsies. And yet, for all my success, they have thrived. I believe they have a safe haven within the walls of this very city. What are we going to do about it, sir? Stamp them out, one by one. You make your point quite vividly, sir. Is she going to be all right? I'm fine. Thanks to Quasimodo. Quasimodo. Where did the creature go? It's... it's up there. Right. Wait. Wait, I'll go with you. Thanks, but stay with her. Quasimodo, did your heart have the answer? <laughs> well, I guess you three got this covered. It was a walk in the park. How would you know? You don't have any legs. Yeah, but... Oh, give me a break. Is this a figure of speech? Both of you pipe down and get ready, because here comes some more. Yeehaw! It's up there. <laughs> yes, let it burn. The flames will consume everything. You see? This is the power that has been granted to me! I see a sad old man with a dark heart. Again, you are wrong! Now you will be judged! Just like the rest! Is mine! 
You're Ansem! Why are you here? Your best friend is never far. So sad. The cost of yielding to the darkness. You could write a book about that. But I embrace the darkness. And unless you hurry up and learn to do the same, your story will end just like his. I walk the road to dawn. Still afraid of the dark, I see. thinks I'm afraid of the dark? No. Not while I have the Keyblade. It will guide me to the light! Master Frollo. He made me live inside the bell tower, but the real walls were the ones I built around my heart. You helped me see that, Riku. I was... speaking from... personal experience. I'd say you still keep a lot locked inside. We all do that sometimes. There are just some things we need to keep separate from the world at large. At least until we have time to figure them out. <sighs> I know the road my heart walks. One dream is connected to another, which means we must choose in which sleeping world you will begin. I will return you to the Destiny Islands just before they were swallowed by the darkness and plunged into sleep. Lead this task and return here safely, and I will name you both True Masters. Stop her! <laughs> huh? You there! Have you seen a gypsy woman? Nope. Sorry. All right. Thanks. I'm terribly sorry, sir. We've lost her. Mm, slippery vermin. I'm beginning to question having summoned you back from the wars, Captain Phoebus. Once dreams take you, you must let them guide you to the sleeping worlds. As there are seven pure lights, there are seven sleeping keyholes. Unlocking these will both grant you new powers and free the worlds from their wakelessness. Compl